when you consider a computer game as a user experience, I feel like you have to consider everything. So the discovery of the game, the, the branding of it, um, you know, the website, the Twitter account, um, the trailers, this, these are all like the perception of the game and, and how it's consumed. And so whether a game is accessed for free and then you ask money for more content or whether it's a subscription or whether it's a box copy or whether it's a, you know, a digital thing that, that lives in the cloud, I think that has an impact on, on the game design. And what we see, I think, is conflicts when the way that you consume it doesn't match well with the way that the game is designed, right? Um, so with Monument Valley, from the very start, we said that this game is going to be about quality and beauty, and you're supposed to fall in love with it. So it doesn't make any sense to give this beautiful, lovable thing out for free and then try to remind people to pay money for it or stick ads in it, right? That's a, that's a mismatch. Um, this is a premium experience. And so we're going to assign it a premium price tag. And that's, that's kind of a very honest way of signaling to the, the player what, what they're in for, you know? Like $4, that's a ludicrous price for a mobile game, but it must be good, right? They, it must be so good that they're going to ask for this ridiculous amount of money up front. Uh, and certainly, you know, not everybody agreed with us. Some people feel that all mobile games should be free. Uh, and I think that's, that's perhaps a failure of our industry to, to develop a good relationship with the players. You know, there's this, there isn't a good dialogue there. There isn't a good understanding about, I suppose, value. Um, and, you know, we feel really confident, really comfortable about the way that we priced our game because it's, it's honest. Like, we feel like asking, you know, the price of a cup of coffee for what we think is a really good game and then asking for a couple bucks more when we release a bunch of levels, um, that's an honest way for us to make a living.